Hi, everybody. How are you doing on this fine, perfect day? That's great. Well, anyway, I got a question for you guys. Do you know the man called Wayne Allwine? If you don't know, I'll explain it to you. Wayne Allwine was the man who was born in 1947. He has a wife named Rusi Taylor, and they got married in 1991. And plus, he has kids named Peter, Aaron, Christopher, and Joshua, and he has a grandson named Isaac, which I'm guessing they live somewhere in California, maybe. Maybe Sacramento. Well, anyway, Wayne Allwine was best known for doing the voice of Mickey Mouse since, 19 since 1977, and he also did Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, House of Mouse, and Mickey Mouse Works. And plus, he also did movies like Mickey's Christmas Carol, Fantasia 2000, Mickey's Magical Christmas, Snowden at the House of Mouse, Mickey's House of Villains, Mickey, Doll, and Goofy, The Three Musketeers, and The Lion King One Half. Which, I found something really weird, because I haven't seen The Lion King One Half. I don't know what it's about. I'm guessing it's the restart of The Lion King after the deleted song, The Morning Report, which was the special edition of The Lion King back in 2002. Mm-hmm. Yep, we all know about Wayne Allwine. He also, I know he did Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, but he also did Mickey's Great Clubhouse Hunt. Yep, that was the only special Mickey Mouse Clubhouse special that Wayne Allwine did. Yep. But then, something terrible just happened on May 18th, 2009. Oh yes. Wayne Allwine passed away of a heart attack at age 62 in Los Angeles, California, due to his diabetes. Yep. Yep, this is why the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse TV special, Choo Choo Express, was dedicated to the memory of him. Yep. But then, after, after when Wayne Allwine passed away, his original voice of Mickey Mouse kept on going at the Disney parks. Yep. His original voice of Mickey Mouse kept on going at Disney World cuz I remember one time during my Disney World vacation last year in 2014, we went to go see the Festival of Fantasy Parade. And yes, I saw Wayne Allwine's voice of Mickey. I heard it the whole time. It's not Brent Allwine's or Jimmy McDonald's or anything else. Yep, I can hear it. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you something. Before Wayne Allwine did any of those movies, he also did Mickey's Christmas Carol. Yep, I loved Mickey's Christmas Carol. Besides, I had the DVD. And plus, it also came with Mickey's Magical Christmas Snowden at the House of Mouse. Yep. And plus, since Wayne Allwine passed away of a heart attack, his original voice of Mickey Mouse kept on going during the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse show. And yep, after when he died, his original voice kept on going from 2009 to 2012, until Brent Awan was chosen to be the best voice of Mickey. Yep, his debut was the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse episode, Mickey and Donald Have a Farm, which premiered on Disney Junior on November 5th, 2012. Yep. And about my sister, she was like, what happened to Mickey? And I was like, like, it's Brent Awan's voice, cause, cause uh, we were watching the Minnie Mouse special, The Wizard of Diz, and I told her, I told her that it was Brent Alwan's voice of Mickey. So, so that's not Wayne Alwine's. It was Brent Alwan's. So yeah. 
Well, anyway, that's what my video is about, guys. I decided to, uh, make a video of this called... Called, uh, about this, cause... I heard that February 7th is gonna be Wayne Allwine's birthday, even though he died already. And plus, if he was alive already, he would be 68 years old. Yep. If Wayne Allwine was here already, he would be 68 years old, and he would be like, Oh my god, I'm 68 already, and, but, where am I? Am I in heaven? Yeah, that would be really awkward. Yep, that would be the awkward moment of him. By the way, guys, do you know that Wayne Allwine's middle name is Anthony? Oh, yes. Oh yes, I checked it out on the Wikipedia. They say that Wayne Allwine's middle name is Anthony. And plus, I did know his middle name was Anthony. I thought he doesn't have a middle name. <laughs> that would be cool. Yep. By the way, I can still imagine if Wayne Allwine did the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse live on stage in 2007. That would be the first Mickey Mouse Clubhouse concert to be performed at the Sydney Entertainment Center. Yep. I can imagine if they did a Mickey Mouse Clubhouse concert there. Yep. The first concert. Mm-hmm. I can still imagine. Yep. So, yeah. I guess that's it. That's all the time we have now, cause if you guys like this video, if you guys like this video about talking about Wayne Allwine, just if you if you guys like if you guys like this video of me talking about Wayne Allwine, just just comment down below on YouTube, cause we want to know what we want to know what your response says after this video. And plus, give me about 19 comments. Or maybe 10. Cause... Cause, um, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe you guys know Wayne Allwine like I do. And plus, we can... We can remember Wayne Allwine together. Yep. Well, anyway, if you guys like this video, Give me the comments. We want to know what you say and what your reaction will say. And let me know if you like this video. Okay? Give us your answer, guys. I'll see you later. Bye.